Hi there folks, Skid Row here. Welcome back to the Rough Road Homestead. So rabbit feet are finished, so it's time to move on to our next project. Although I'm not done processing all the furs we have, I do have a few that are finished and ready to be used for something fun. So I wanted to show you what I'm doing today and maybe you guys have some suggestions. So let's go take a look. All right, so what we're doing today is putting together a shoulder wrap for my seven-year-old. So the plan is to put these together just as a simple wrap. And because I'm just doing a simple, simple shoulder wrap, I'm not overly concerned on perfect shaped pieces. So I'm okay with this bottom edge being uneven. That's okay by me. Um, I want to minimize waste by not having to cut the pieces if I don't have to. So this is the back. These are two pieces that have been sewn together um, or two pelts that have been sewn together. And I like how well um, the seam is not completely hidden, but it's not overtly obvious. Uh, and as you can see, the direction the fur falls is not perfectly lined up, but it's really, really close. Um, so should it get wet for whatever reason, the water will roll down the fur the same direction that the fur falls. So this is the back, and I have finished sewing the bottom seam across the whole length of this but I just have to I have to do the top even though these um, these pelts were processed and turned out much better than the ones or most of the ones that I did last time it is still really hard on my fingers to get that needle through this hide so I'm wondering maybe I'm gonna have to invest in a sewing machine that is made for working with furs. Now, this here, these two pieces were originally one pelt, and these will be the side pieces that wrap around the front. Now you can tell this hide here, look how thick and luscious that is, is a better quality thickness than what I have here, and that's because these rabbits were butchered at different ages. This is a young rabbit butchered between 12 and 16 weeks. This is a rabbit butchered around four, five months. So another thing I need to consider is if I'm gonna make good quality products for sale, I might have to let them grow out longer. Thinking about it. So. Uh, because my fingers need a break from this, what I'm going to do is put a simple hem around the lining for these pieces, and then we'll get back to you. All right, so I've got both sides stitched up. It's kind of crude, but I just used a waxed thread. So I have that one on as well as this side. So I found it's easier to loop around rather than a classic straight stitch, um, especially when it comes to keeping the hides relatively lined up. So now that those are put together, when you open it up, you have the full length of the hide and I just have to put the lining on. So I'll finish putting the lining on and then I'll show you how it looks. Okay, I have finished the wrap with the exception of some buttons. She picked out some pretty buttons but she was playing with them the other day and now I can't find them. So I'm gonna have to wait till she wakes up in the morning. But the lining, oops is all sewed on. Just got to trim off a few thread tails 
and it's all finished so if you could just imagine a seven-year-old wearing her new fur that's what I'm planning on I hope she likes it I'm pretty sure she will but sometimes you just never know